Good morning, students. In this class, I'll be doing class 10, Savachir Kalvi syllabus or matriculation syllabus. 8th chapter, Statistics. Exercise 8.1, 5th sub. Find the variance and standard deviation of the wages of 9 workers given below. So, for the wages of the 9 workers are given, we are asked to find the variance and the standard deviation. So, the variance is sigma d squared by n. Standard deviation is root of sigma d squared by n. Okay. So, first we will find the arithmetic mean. x bar is equal to sigma x by n. So, sigma x is when we find the sum of all these 9 wages, we are getting 2700 divided by 9. So, this one when we divide, we will get it as 300. So, this is the arithmetic mean. So, now... When we substitute this in the tabular column. So first one is x. That is this 9 wages. 310, 290, 320, 280, 300, 290, 320, 310. And the last one is 280. These are all the information given. Then d is x minus x bar. Then we have to find d squared also. Okay. So x minus x bar. x is this 310. x bar is 300. So 310 minus 300 is 10. 290 minus 300 is minus 10. 320 minus 300 is 20. 280 minus 300 is minus 20. 300 minus 300 is 0. 290 minus 290 minus 300 is minus 10. 320 minus 300 is 20. 310 minus 300 is 10. 280 minus 300 is minus 20. So this is d value. Then d squared will be square of this. So 100. So this is also 100. This is 400. Minus 20 is 400. Then 0. 100. 400. 100. And then 400. So when we find the sum of all these things, we are having 1, 2, 3, 4. So 4, 4s are 16. So 16 is there. So 1, 2, 3, 4. That is 4. So total, we are getting it as 2000. So this is 2000. 2000 is sigma d squared. So sigma d squared is 2000. So now we are asked to find the variance and the standard deviation. So, the variance formula is sigma d squared by n. So, sigma d squared is 2000 here. So, 2000 divided by 9. 2000 divided by 9, we we'll get it as 222.22. This is the value of the variance. Then, standard deviation is, standard deviation is root of this one. Root of Sigma d squared by n. So already we got the value for sigma d squared by n as 222.22. So when we find the root of this, root of 222.22, approximately we we'll get it as 14.91. So this is the standard deviation for the given information. Okay, thank you.